welcome to the latest edition of the 215. I'm Breland Moore. And I'm Mike Jarrett. And before we get into the nitty gritty of today's programming, we first want to take some time out to thank Morton Contemporary Art Gallery for hosting us this week. There's some great stuff here yep. and we're going to show you around soon. Yeah, that's why I wore my artsy boots Ooh, today. Okay? I like that. Yeah. Do you really? Yes. Okay. I like the style. I got some comments <laughs> on the street. Uh, before we get into looking around here, uh, Breland and I, we've probably established that we love to eat. Love. So that's why we're thrilled that we have so many great chefs, national chefs really, uh, right here in the Philadelphia area. And we're gonna visit a beautiful restaurant called Volver. It's in the lobby of the Kimmel Center and it's run by a great chef, Jose Garces. But the w crazy thing is, is that he is actually doing something that no one else seems to be doing. Yep. He's opening up his restaurant for other chefs. Awesome. Action chef, let's do okay, it. <laughs> sounds good. So I'm gonna- uh, Let's get ready here. Yeah, I'm gonna start with a little trout. And the beauty about cooking is, is that it's an art form. It's also it can be inspired from many things, from childhood, from where you're from. And so that story, it, to me, is also like one of the most special things about what we do. Desserts, which we have here, a classic Argentine. Uh, they crepe, where I'm just gonna like fold it up a little oh, bit. Yeah. When I used to open my business 12 years ago, I never imagined that it would lead me to this moment. And then Chef, you have, um, can, can you tell me a little about a few of your dishes that yeah, you're doing here? Yeah, of course. Here? So we have a classic uh, escabeche, which we did with eggplant. That's something my grandma used to make. You know, cooking is really about collaborations in many ways. So this has been a great way to spotlight, um, you know, how, how I approach collaborations in cooking. If you say Argentina, what do you think? I think uh, grilled grilled meats. I think cooking on the grill. Yeah. yeah exactly. There's a lot of talent in Philadelphia. I think that doesn't uh, that maybe gets overlooked, and so we felt like an in chef residency program would be a great way to shine a spotlight and you know bring those folks and their talent to light. Chef Jose Garces email me and say like we have this program coming up. We would love to have you to be part of these and you know, I was super excited. The residencies last anywhere from six to eight weeks. So they have a, f a few different benefits. One, you know, this is this is the Performing Arts Center in Kimmel, we're on Broad and Spruce. It's a, it's a spotlighted restaurant. And so bringing their talents to a place where maybe other folks in the community couldn't reach them or, or, or taste their food is like first and foremost. To be able to have your cuisine come from West Philly and you've been there for 12 years doing your thing and people know you and people travel there to get it. But there are also customers who maybe wouldn't travel out there to get it, who are now, you are reaching those customers and, and they can see and they can taste and they can be part of what it is you're doing. Coming to this iconic landmark right in the center of town, uh, so, you know, that by itself has a lot of exposure. Um, I think like just also for me to be able to have Northwest Argentine cuisine feature here, it's also very special and people are like raving about it. You know, when they have the locro dish or when they have the empanadas or when they have the pancakes, these are classics from uh, Northwest Argentina. And then just to see them here, it's spruced up, right, like a little more fancy. And then to know that also the food that is very, like everyday food in Argentina can be featured that way in this landmark. It's, it's, it's super special. For you, how do you benefit from it? I mean, we know you're a top villa in the city, right? <laughs> but to have these young chefs and these up and coming chefs in your space. I think it's, honestly, it's a, it's a privilege and an honor for me to have these, these folks in our space, for me to be able to collaborate and cook with them and kind of get to know their food, get to know their food philosophy, for them to look at what we do and how we run our operation here. So it's, it's very much a collaborative effort. And um, yeah, it's, it's just, it's a lot of fun. The way to have it for me, so there we go. And I love your Papa Sala Chapa. One of my favorite <laughs> and each residency lasts only six to eight weeks, so <laughs> definitely get on over there and check them all out. So you will see us about every eight weeks <laughs> over right. at Volver. On a rotation. What